tits out. Okay. I don't have any tits. All right. Introduce yourself. Okay. I'm Aaliyah, 28 years old, single, obviously, and I'm looking for love. Atomic love. I guess. Was that good? Yeah. No, you're a natural. Okay. Um, first question. <clears throat> what do you look for in a potential date? Oh, yeah. okay. Um, shit. Should have prepared something. Um, Thoughtful, considerate, kind. You can always tell when someone's kind, yeah. it's in their eyes, you know. Um, rich, <laughs> shit. Um, maybe let's come yeah, back to this fine. one. Um, okay, well, it's, uh, how long did it? No. <clears throat> um, would you, okay, here's one, actually. Uh, if you could holiday anywhere in the world, where would it be? Mallorca. <laughs> you had that up your sleeve. Well, I've always wanted to go. Yeah, but you don't look like it. How am I supposed to look? Alluring, you know, seductive. Like you have a secret you want to share, but you won't say it. Okay? Okay. Um. My secret is that I want to go to Mallorca. <laughs> No, 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 no. Okay, let me show you. Let me show you. Let me help you. <clears throat> uh, if I could go anywhere in the world for a holiday, uh, I guess it would be Mallorca. <laughs> Lady Di went there last year. She wore that beautiful yellow jumpsuit. Ah, oh, so stunning. <laughs> See, now they're imagining me in a tight yellow jumpsuit. Oh, I don't know. Okay, look. Just ask me a question. I'll be you. Um, okay. Tell me about yourself. No, that's boring. Get specific. What do you look for in a man? Ah, um... I want someone to have fun with. Someone who can make me laugh. <laughs> A provider. Play up to their ego, play the damsel in distress. You've got it. All right. <clears throat> Okay. Lee, it's just you and me. Just talk to me. Tell me about your family. Um, my mum was Welsh. Mm -hmm. Single mum. Um, she didn't have much confidence in men in general. Um, she always wanted me to have an easier life than she did, which I do. You know, I've got. Great apartment, good job. She spent a lot of money fixing my teeth. I had braces for seven years, the whole of high school. She had really, really shocking teeth. They were just stacked on top of one another. She had this big gap where one never came down. She didn't like much. I remember whenever I complained that she said she'd always imagined what it would be like to be treated different because you're treated different, better, when you have a good smile. Especially if you're a young girl. I cried after they put my braces on. And she told me I shouldn't worry that when they take them off, the whole world is going to smile with me. I didn't even wear my retainer. All that money went down the drain. Oh, I think you have lovely teeth. <laughs> I'm talking about my teeth. Yes. Do I look okay? Mm -hmm. I'm a mess. <laughs> my fucking teeth and now my mascara. You can cut that out. Yes, right? like magic. Oh, it was her birthday on the weekend. Oh. Jesus. I think she's just on my mind. Yeah. 
And I dropped out of high school, remember? You lasted until the end. I should have been a nurse. There's plenty of old nurses. No. Do you remember Diana, the girl who trained me? She yeah. was let go because they were downsizing the department. But the girls said it was because she didn't marry. They're building a whole new floor next month. No one over 30 works in my department. I mean, no 30-year-old typists. Just get a better job. We hated it there. No, I don't hate it there. I loved it. Sometimes. Oh, it's not the point anyway. What's the point then? All my friends are married now. You're married. It's like I turned around one day and everyone's gone. Or partnered up. No one told me. And they all have kids, which is wonderful, and I'm just there, I guess. I think my problem is when I meet someone at work or at a bar or in a fucking park, whatever, I just kind of freeze up. I'm usually confident. You are. I think, I'm, I think I'm funny and kind and smart. Well, I can be smart. I'm not at maths, I was terrible at maths, but other things like how to pay bills on time. You know, I'm organised, I guess, which is a kind of smart. Yeah. I don't know. Anyway, when I meet a man, an attractive man, I just think he's somehow going to laugh at me. Yeah, trying to flirt. <laughs> I just can't do it. You can. You've always been great at flirting. I just, I just feel ridiculous. Because who would want to flirt with me? I mean, really, who would pick me? Clearly no one. No one at all. You must think I'm ridiculous because you and David, why else would you be making me do this video dating thing? Oh. Look, Lee, to be honest, I just, I want you to get married so I can stop hanging out with these awful wives. Oh, you can just come back to work. I can't. I'm trying for a baby, Lee. You are? Yeah. With David? Yeah, yeah with David. Who, who, who the fuck else do you think I have there? You were my maid of honour. Do you think this whole thing's a joke? Oh, I just never thought that what? you were right. I'm married, Aaliyah. Don't you know what that means? I guess not. Everyone's always trying to give me advice. You go outside more, get some hobbies. It's the reason why I got a fucking dog so I could meet some men, but it just shits everywhere. I hate my dog. I don't even think that I, I don't even think I want to get married. I've always, I've always found my friendships with women to be more, I don't know. I go to a bar, I buy a drink, I sit there and I wait for a man to come up to me. But when they do, what then? It always seems so easy for you. It always seems so easy for everyone else. But it never feels true or real. I think I just kept dragging myself to those bars just so I could be with you. And the best nights were the ones where no one came up to us or when all the men were too horrible to talk to. It was just you and me all night. And I think that's why I can't find that anywhere with anyone except for you. Do you think I feel the same way? <laughs>